where are we? It seems like we somehow teleported to the Kung Fu Panda world! W wait a minute, why are we pandas? How did this even happen? Well, don't you guys remember? It all started when we were at school. We found that mysterious scroll in my desk. It was an invitation to a competition sent by Poe. And when I accepted, the scroll started shining brightly. And I guess it was the portal that ended up leading us to this world. Oh my god, look, it's Poe! Welcome to the Jade Palace! I've summoned here the best robotics teams in all of Canada. And I did this for one reason. <laughs> Lord Chen, that's right. The Lord Chen is building a robot to destroy the Valley of Peace. He probably wants to avenge his defeat. Which is kind of my fault, because I did totally kung fu his face. Now, only one team is going to be able to help us fight him. That'll be the winners of the bestest, awesomest tournament ever. Invicta! Now obviously, there are some rules to follow. Your robot must start the game in the center of the field and will be surrounded by prisms located in five different zones. And your bot starts the game with one prism preloaded. From a set of 25, you'll choose one structure that you'll have five minutes to build inside of the scoring zone. Points are rewarded for prisms in their right position. And the harder the structure, the more points you get. You can even multiply your points if you're able to place a delicious dumpling in the hoop. The less time you take to place the dumpling, the higher your multiplier will be. This year, the competition will be held from the 15th to the 17th of April 2021. It's gonna take the most bodacious and epic team to face off against the enemy. So naturally, only the winner of this legendary battle is gonna have a chance of defeating Shen's machine. Not only will you guys have to build a totally sweet robot, but you're also going to have to master this cool kung fu mind control technique to be able to move the robot and complete the tasks. Or you could program the robot too. That, that's cool too. Also, you're going to have to make two videos. One to describe the game you're going to be participating in and demonstrate the cool tricks your robot can do. And the other is a tutorial that teaches participants something useful, like making noodles. What was that? It has to do... it has to do with the competition. Oh. So, so not making noodles? Right. Okay guys, now, you guys also need to create a website where you will place information that's gonna help us learn more about the robot, your team, and Invicta. Finally, you're gonna have to pitch how you decided to approach the competition and show us your progress throughout the months leading to this legendary battle. All right, I'll summon you guys back to my world for the competition. I wish you luck, and I can't wait to see what you guys have prepared. Welcome back! So, well, show me what you prepared. Our robot will be still in the starting zone. The intake is held by an arm which can extend and rotate around the field. The rollers on the intake slide the prisms between two parallel sheets of polycarbonate slanted at an angle of about 45 degrees. Tilting the plates vertically drops the prisms in the construction zone. To multiply the points gained by the structure, a pivoting ramp guides the dumpling into the hoop. Independent coaxial shafts prevent the ramp from rotating with the robot arm, thus maintaining its tilt directed toward the hoop. Encoders and conveniently located sensors control and limit the motion of the robot parts. Building this robot had its challenges. The choice of cards and strategies, and taking and stacking the prism, fitting the robot in the starting zone while still allowing for maximum extension and obviously programming. We tested several designs and iterations before reaching a stable configuration we can score points with. Oh, Shen! Dude, you better be prepared. We are coming for you. <laughs>